Hello and welcome to all our 1000 PS fans. I am here at the ICMA in Italy. Of course, one very big traditional Italian brand is here too, Ducati. Next to me is Giulio Malaga Malagoli, yes. um, head of product marketing. Yes. So, oh, wow, well, I did it. Uh, Giulio, we are in front of a very new bike. It's called 1299 Panigale. Could you tell me something about this new bike? Yes, this is the new Panigale, as you told it, 1299. Speaking about the new component, first of all, we have the engine. The engine, by the name itself, is more or less 100cc more respect uh, the past. So it's almost uh, 1300cc, the displacement. We have 10 horsepower more respect the 1199 Panigale. Now the maximum uh, power is 205 horsepower. And uh, the maximum torque is 144 newton meters. That this is very important because the um, we have a um, higher torque at every RPM, especially at low uh, and mid range. The increase of RPM respect past year is more or less about the 10%, so you can feel it uh, very well. But the engine is not, is not the only things that uh, has changed. We have um, design, some uh, changes in the design, so the front part of the bike is different, is wider, so you, the rider is uh, well uh, protected. So it, it's uh, it's better for also for the wrist rack. The tail is completely new, mm -hmm. and also the lower part of the fairing is new. And uh, other improvement, we have other improvements in the electronic uh, package. Uh, first of all, the most important thing in the S version is the um, suspension. I mean, front fork shock absorber and steering damper that are uh, all made by Onins, and they, I uh, and they have um, um, electronically. Um, uh, related one, one to the other and uh, it, this is very important because there is a new um, a, a new system that change the setting of the suspension with an event based uh, um, strategy I mean uh, if you are on a racetrack and you brake very hard in this moment in that moment the compression of the front fork will be increased only during braking after in, in cornering, you will have when um, the um, EMU, the, the central unit, you recognize the leaning angle, recognize that you are uh, at very high leaning angle, uh, the compression and the rebound will be very, very soft. So you have a lot of feeling. And for instance, in the exit of the corner, when you open the throttle, the rear shoulder will be uh, uh, harder. So to, to give you, you more. Uh, uh, more uh, uh, confidence in, in a hard acceleration. So it's something we, we say event-based because related to what the rider is doing, the setting change in that moment. So it's very, very important for uh, rest track use, but also for the street use because outside the racetrack, in, uh, instantaneously, all the uh, compression and rebound will change to have, or to have also a good comfort for a sport bike. So a semi-active system. Um, if there somebody wants to uh, ride the super bike, uh, the, the engine is too big to, uh, to, to do that. So you have another model, this Paligale R, uh, for these guys. Yes, for, for us, uh, the super bike racing is very important. It's our history since more than 20 years. So the, um, we have the Panigale R with the same uh, aesthetic of the 1299, but with an engine uh, with the displacement that is uh, 1199, uh, 1199, so it's uh, uh, good for the regulation, but with the same horsepower. So it's uh, a so-called of super bike tune engine with very um, exclusive component and material to have the same horsepower than the, the other bike but with a very quick rev engine because it's very light it's very for a racetrack professional use it's uh, uh, considered that it's six kilo, kilos uh, lighter than the current 1199R that was uh, the lightest bike in this, in, in this category for instance the, all the exhaust system is made by titanium to give you an example so uh, this is for really racing and what about the prices? The prices for the 1299 Panigale in Austria, in, uh, we have the 1299 is um, a little less than 25,000 euro, and the S is 29,900 uh, euro. 
For DR, it's something about that 30, uh, 33,000. Thank you, Julio, for the interview. You're welcome. Ciao.